So we are currently on our way down the Flora Peninsula, Route 31 is what it's called. The first stop was supposed to be O'Sullivan's Beach, which we have graded a solid... So we're now at Christie's, which, as you can see, is pretty gorgeous. You can't see from this far away, but Brit's out there showing up all the locals down here at Southport Noolunga. Get it, girl. And while she's out there shredding it, I'm just on a romantic walk for one. Out here, along the beautiful coastline. Pretty special, right? ourselves a cozy spot at the old Dinger Sharks footy ground where we're going to give ourselves a bit of a workout. Brit's starting us off with some dead crabs. They're not our dead crabs are they Brit? Dead bugs, yeah. Oh well, how many did you do? How many more to go? discovered where the word Pongi comes from. We're driving through a town called Maya Ponga and it is incredibly Pongi. Uh, you can taste the sourness on your tongue. So we learned through a quick Google search that people from Maya Ponga came to normal cities and when they left everyone used to talk to them about God. Weren't they a bit of a Ponga? And then obviously being Australian we like to throw a Y at the end of things so Pongi. And now it is the word it is today. That's definitely shit water. Yeah. It smells like poop. It smells like shit here. Actual human feces. So if you look closely, you can see a Mazda stuck right there on the sand. That's alright though. We're gonna give him a give him a tug out. So did we have ourselves a success story, Brit? Nicely done. Haven't had to use the trucks for ourselves yet, but there you go. Always good to carry a pair because you don't know what type of people you'll come across. So today marks a very important day. I've caught my first fish. It's only a herring, but I'm pretty excited by it. Even though Brick can catch blue eye with her bare hands, I had to catch this one with a rod. Let's see how it tastes. Herring for dinner, squid for dessert. Just waiting for the chef to prep it all. What are you doing there, Brit? What are you cooking up, James? Uh, yesterday's catch. So we've got some squid and some abs. Yum. Breakfast of champions, eh? <laughs> oh yeah. So we've just cooked ours up in some oil, with salt and pepper. 
If anybody has any good cooking instructions on how to best do an abalone or squid, muchly appreciate it. Ours were caught by Brit Kamari. We got one ab each, but Brit let me get the ab. I couldn't actually spot any when we were diving, so she found them both and was kind enough to let me grab it. This is pretty nice.